guys, it's running kimono. So here is the little weather report. It is Daisy approved. It's a hot one today, probably about 80 degrees outside. Special hello to my mom. I know she watches all these videos and she loves the weather report. So there it is. And Daisy says, hello, tap your tail, Daisy. Okay, so we have a couple stores today. We have Bath and Body Works. Uh, they have a special on their candles. I'll talk about that in a second where they're actually $8 each. And it's just today, which is a really great price. Uh, we have a little bit of Walgreens action. You guys know I want this deal. So I just went really hard today and got a whole bunch of stuff. And then over there we have Kmart. Um, I'm going to talk about the Kmart free cash in a second. Believe it or not, I got $22 of stuff for free today. It includes two things of parchment paper, a little crate, and then a little thing for cookies. So very, very pleased with that. Um, so first store that we have today is Bath and Body Works. Um, these candles are usually like $12.50 with the sale, but today they're on some sort of special promotion that when you use this coupon, the 10 off for 40 and you buy four, they will drop down to $8 each. So with this coupon, when you buy them in the increments of four, you don't need to buy four, but say you buy $40 of stuff, that'll drop it down to eight bucks. Um, but you know, to pay $8 for these candles, I know they have the candle sale in December, like the first or second week, and they're usually like $8.75. So this is even cheaper than the candle sale. Um, and I asked my cashier, I said, Hey, if you wanted one of these coupons, you know, could any customer get it? And she's like, absolutely. But you got to buy the price point of 40 bucks. Um, so here's what I got today. Um, I got this London, um, tea and lemon and it smells like earl grey tea and it's just a really pleasant scent and um i bought three of them because a couple days ago when the sale just started i asked um my cashier i said hey do you have any of that and they're like no we ordered some but it was on a very limited amount i think they only had like 10 candles so i picked up three um i know a lot of you probably thought i would get all 10 but i just got three and this one it's called um sweet cherry pie um this is a very unique candle. I think they released it a couple years ago and because of the sale, they're releasing it again. So it's kind of a rare one and it actually smells like cherry pie. And these are the sort of candles that I absolutely love, ones with notes of baking. And then of course that tea one, cause it's just the bomb, but this one, you know, it's really nice. Um, so another thing I always do when I'm shopping these sales is make sure that the wicks are not burnt because sometimes um, you might get a, a wick that's burnt and then if you gift that to say, oh, your mother-in-law, it's just embarrassing to give her a used candle. Um, so this is what I did today. Um, after this coupon, they're eight bucks each. Um, so basically I got four of them. After the 10 off of 40, uh, it's 32 bucks. I used a $20 I bought a gift card. Um, and you can do that. Uh, they have Bath and Body Works gift cards now. I think it's only certain regions that have it because I know some people were complaining saying, I don't have it. So, sorry guys. So I had $20 on my Avada account I utilized. Um, so I paid $12 plus tax. And um, you can either get your Ibotta gift cards in uh, the 20 or the $50 um, increments. I think maybe why Michigan is part of this for Ibotta is because a lot of the test stores for Bath and Body Works, because they're located out of Ohio. I think um, because it's such a big Bath and Body Works, like, you know, region, that's probably why Ibotta really pushes that. And there are a lot of Bath and Body Works around here. So anyhow, after I paid for all of this, I got this little coupon and it was really, really great. Um, so if you really like these um, candles, um, I would grab four, use the email or ask your cashier for this and um, it would, Drop it down to $8 each or 32 bucks for the four, which is really, really great. If you have not signed up for Ibotta or if you've been on the fence about it, to get this sort of stuff at a discount with an app, you know, that has Bath and Body Works gift cards, sign up, use my code in the notes and you'll get uh, a $10 bonus when you sign up and submit your first qualifying receipt. It's absolutely amazing. And, um, you know, to get this stuff this week, I've, I've gone shopping there like two or three times. I've used a couple Ibotta gift cards and it's just really nice to get this stuff at a reduced cost. And I love candles. This is like my passion. I absolutely love them. And um, I love how they smell. And these are three that I will absolutely enjoy. I think I'm going to gift a couple of them, but just really, really nice. And always make sure to ask for those gift bags too when you're at Bath and Body Works. So absolutely happy, happy, happy with this haul. And the candles with this for eight bucks is today only, uh, which is Friday. So um, 
you might want to hop out to the mall really quick. Okay, the next store that we have is Walgreens, and yes, I did this deal again. I've been doing it all week because I'm out of control. I grabbed two of these Morning Sun uh, Suavitel fabric softeners, four of these um, blue ones, it's called uh, Field Flowers, four of the Palm Olives, two Fabuloso floor cleaners, most stores don't really have a lot of these. And then I grabbed um, eight of these Walgreens, uh, Wall Dry um, Antihistamine uh, pills. Um, I really suffer from very, very bad allergies. And this might seem like excessive. And I know I was like giving a, a royal lecture about the Aleve, but this stuff, like every night I'm taking two or three um, cause my allergies are that bad. And if I don't do it, I can't talk in the morning cause my throat is like all closed up. I have um, really bad allergies. I don't know why. Um, and it just, if I take this stuff, I'm okay. But say I forget or I fall asleep early, like the next day I'm just in pain. Runny nose is the worst too. So this stuff is really fantastic and um, yeah, to, to even pay a buck for each, um, I'll absolutely pay that. A lot of people were saying, I can't take this at, during the daytime because I fall asleep. Yes, um, this ingredient is will put you to sleep. Um, so I always take this in the evening. I will never take it during the daytime or when I'm driving my car. So just note that. So if you have like, if you take a sleeping pill and you just pass out, um, this antihistamine, um, it's very similar. Um, so just be really careful about that, guys. So eight of those, I think I'm done with that because I got a bunch yesterday. So let's look at the math. Um, they are two for seven. So I got four of them at 28 bucks and I rolled points for this because this is on a promotion this month where when you buy two, you get back 5,000 points. So um, basically what I got was um, 20,000 points back because I got, uh, you know, four sets of them. So that's the equivalency of 22 bucks. So not bad when you buy them in that increment. Um, it was a loss of six bucks because I rolled a whole bunch of points today. Um, and again, nighttime only to take these allergy meds because um, it, 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 some people get drowsy when they take it. Now, for all of these items, this guy, the, the Fabuloso, the Palm Olive, and the Suavitel, these guys are on a monthly promotion for $1.99 for two for $3.98. And when you pay or when you buy them in that increment, um, you will get back. 2,000 points, so it drops it down to 99 cents each. So for this haul, guys, I got um, eight of these and then 12 of these. That's a lot. Altogether, it is a price point of $51.88. I used $50 of points, 40,000. So I paid $1.88 plus tax, and then I got back 32,000. I got 20 for these um, allergy meds, and then I also got back 12,000 for all this cleaning stuff. So for me today, this was a loss of, after the points, you subtract them. Um, I basically lost $13 of points for this. But if you take that $13 and divide it by like the 20 plus items I have here, it amounts to paying 65 cents for each. So if you were looking to stock up on some of these meat and potatoes kind of items at Walgreens, um, you know, doing it in a bigger amount, like buying $50 at a time, and that's the way to do it. If your store is super strict, this will probably be a no-go. Like if you live in a little town, um, they're probably just gonna say no. But the stuff, I had no coupons for it, and I was just buying it all um, in flipping points. So basically I paid $1.88 uh, plus tax, so like five bucks out of pocket, and then I got back 32,000 points, which is the equivalency of 37 bucks. So just a killer deal. Um, I think I might be done. I might do it one more time, just this stuff because this stuff sells really well at stockpile sales. Okay, the last store that we have is Kmart. And I can I finished a survey um last week and it was if you it was just a survey about buying kids toys and if you completed it you got $10 in free cash. And it was expiring soon, so there's a Kmart like I don't know, about 30 minutes from me, so I went to it. And so what I did was I went right to the um, customer service booth and I asked uh, the customer service rep, I said, hey, is there any chance that you could possibly um, look on my card and tell me um, what I can buy? Because there are so many exclusions. That's the, the kicker that if you don't know what you're doing, you can get really confused. And I don't really sh shop a lot at Kmart on the regular. And she said, you can't buy any cleaning stuff. You can't buy any like shampoo, beauty, healthcare stuff. And you also can't buy any food. So I'm like, oh, okay, what can I buy? And she's like, anything like bedding or if you wanted to buy anything in the baking, cooking, you know, cookie sheet sort of stuff. So this is what I got in transaction one, because uh, one 
one I had a paper for $12 of free cash and then I had like a loadable $10 of free cash. So just make sure to go to customer service and ask. That is the best thing to do. So I picked up this parchment paper in the cooking section. I hate paying for this. And then I got this big scoop for um, like baking and that sort of stuff, you know, just a new one. Everything we have is so old and ratty. So this I think after tax was like a buck. And then I got one of these crates I thought I could use for a future stockpile sale, put all these goodies inside of. This was $4.99 and another parchment paper. And this was like, um, another like dollar purchase. So really, really great. Um, you might want to log into your Kmart account, see if you might have any um, free cash points or shop your way, use them. I, I don't know how much longer Kmart can do this. Um, probably in the last month or so, I've gotten like $150 of stuff just totally for free, just for going and using their free cash, which is really strange. But anyhow, very happy to have it. And um, yeah, that's it. So that's it for this video, guys. Um, I will see you in my next one. Bye.